The phase two Alara trial um, was a study in uh, patients with follicular lymphoma um, that had failed uh, two prior lines of therapy. Um, overall, it was uh, you know a heavily pretreated patient population, um, and uh, all of these patients um, had either uh, relapsed or refractory disease. Um, uh, a significant proportion of the patients had progression of disease within 24 months of initial therapy, which is associated with um, you know poor uh, outcomes uh, longitudinally. Um, and, and within that study, uh, patients were uh, underwent apheresis and uh, collection for uh, tisagen like Lucil, which is the same product that's clinically approved now for BALL, along with uh, aggressive large B cell lymphoma. Um, and really encouraging results from that study showing uh, high response rates, including uh, complete response rates. Um, we still do need to wait on some of the maturation of that data um, as, uh, as, you know, being a, a indolent disease, um, this is uh, you know something certainly where we need more longer term follow up to to really better understand outcomes. But uh, I think uh, certainly uh, it does um, you know ideally extend the the cellular therapy footprint for for tisagen like Lucil um, as as we've seen um, you know CAR T cell therapy also uh, be now utilized in that setting uh, in the context of uh, axicatrigine cellulose, which was recently FDA approved for, for follicular earlier this year.